What's up, YouTube? Welcome to episode. This is what we got in the mail today. We do autographs through the mail. We like the autographs of football and baseball and basketball and golf and hockey and celebrities, all kinds of stuff. We also have three blind trades we're going to show you. We like doing blind trades. You send me anything you want up to like seven cards. And I'll send you back seven cards, different cards. And I'll try to keep them about the same era, the same players, the, not the same players, but, you know, same caliber of players. You send me a Hall of Famer, I'll send you a Hall of Famer, you know, I'll show you here at the end. But, hey, let's see what we got. Six for six in 66 days. Wow, this one took a while. Oh, this is cool. I like this guy. Kermit Alexander. 71 tops. 69 tops. There's a 68 tops. Uh, Philadelphia card, Philadelphia card, and a Philadelphia card. I don't know, a few of those I didn't have for my sets. I'm not sure which ones, but this is the second time I've sent the Kermit. Two for two in 66 days. Man, we got a lot of 66 days ones already. Uh, ben Coates, nice. Some tops and some ultra. 95 ultra or something, maybe? I don't know. I don't pay attention. No, 90s football's not my style. One for one in 30 days. Ken Holtzman for the set, 71 tops. Love that 71 set, they look good. Six for six in 24 days. Tom Poquette, 81 tops, 79 tops, 77 tops with a rookie trophy there. 78 tops, 80 tops, and 82 tops. Six for six in 24 days. Dave McKay, 83 Donruss, 82 Donruss. 81 Donruss, 82 tops, 79 tops, and a 77 tops. Uh, three for three in 24 days. Orlando Mercado, 84 tops, 85 tops, 87 tops. I'm working really hard on these three sets. I'm not sure if I need those or not. We'll find out. Five for five in 24 days. Jim Willoughby, Jim Willoughby, 76 tops, 78 tops. 77 tops, 73 tops, and a 74. So we've got 73, 74, 76, 77, 78. We're missing the 75. I don't know if we have that one at home or not. One for one in 27 days, it looks like. I'm working on this set, too. I'm not going to get very many of them signed. i got maybe 15 or 18 of them now. Art Dittmer, 55 Bowman. Not the best of condition, but I don't care. I just want the autograph. Six for six in 27 days. Mike Bilecki, 89 tops, 89 Fleer, uh, 93 Stadium Club, 88 score, nice, 95 Fleer rookie, and a 91 Bowman, I believe. I like that rookie card. I don't think Ron Robinson signs his mail, or that would have been nice to get a duel. This was a $5 fee, two for two in 15 days. Ah, oh, yeah, here's some old ones. Don't think he's a fee, but I went ahead and sent him five bucks anytime. And I just sent to him like a month or two ago. So anytime I send these guys really quick, especially if they're older players, they didn't make a lot of money, so I like to help them out. You know, they can buy coffee or breakfast on me that day, you know? But there's a 55 Bowman and a 50, maybe one Bowman. I'm not sure what year that is. But those are awesome. I like those. Three for six in 27 days. Jeff Husson. 92 Stadium Club. 91 Stadium Club. 90 tops. And he did not sign those. I'll have to send those back out to him. I will, that would look cool signed. We don't mind. We'll send them back out. Three for three in 163 days. Ah, NASCAR guy. Elliot Sadler. He signed three of three. I think I got some more cards I need to send to him. $10 fee, three for three in 15 days. Let's see if it's a fee or if I was just sending it to him. Oh, this guy said, you know, last few things I saw, he wasn't signing. He sent notes, said he didn't sign anymore. And I wanted these cards signed, so I sent $10 and three cards, and he signed them for me. So $10 and three cards might get you Gary Collins if you want them. There's a 68, a 70, and a 71. I'm a, you know, I was a Browns fan back in the day. Uh, like Greg Pruitt was my favorite player. You know, uh, I don't think he played with Greg. I think, you know, he played more in the late 60s and early 70s. But still, 
thought it was cool. So I thought it was worth 10 bucks for me. And speaking of Browns, this was in 14 days. And he sent my letter back unsigned. And it says, I'm returning your stuff because he doesn't want to open it because of the COVID. And it's Paul Warfield. I'm not sure if that's signed or or it's already pre-printed or whatever. But we'll find out. So that's everything we got, guys. So it's 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 13, 14, counting the uh, Paul Warfield, if that's autographed. So 14 returns today. I want to thank you guys for watching. I want to thank everybody that signed my cards. And now let's do the blind trade time. All right. We had somebody that didn't want me to mention their name. He sent me, or she, he or she, they sent me this uh, 89 Tops Carl Lee, who went to Marshall, I believe, uh, 78 Jim Tyrone, and a Marcel Latchman. I have this card already. Don't know if I have this card. I know I need that card. So let's see what I sent him. We'll make it easy. Boop. We're going to send him a Mike Paul for the related Marcel Latchman. And for the Carl Lee, we're going to send him David Fulcher, who was a great safety. And for the Jim Tyrone, we're going to send him Rob Andrews of the same set. So hopefully he needs those, or she needs those. And then we had somebody else that didn't want me to mention their name. I didn't have to mention the name, so uh, they sent me a Frank Reich, 92 tops, a 93 Chris Donalds, an 81 Mickey Klutz, and a 92 Tommy Green. I think I needed the Frank Reich. I don't think I have that. The Donalds, I think I might need. The Klutz, I, I have, and the Tommy Green, I have. So let's see what I'm trading him. Or her. Okay, for Frank Reich, we're trading Neil Lomax. I think they're pretty comparable. Uh, Chris Donalds, we're trading Eric Wedge. Because it's the same year. I thought maybe if they're putting that set together, they might need that one. And Mickey Klutz, 81 tops there. We're trading a Dyer Miller, 81 tops. And for this Tommy Green, we're going to trade him a Scrap McGregor, 88 tops they're both pretty good pitchers and the third blind trade is our buddy johnny serena he's got a channel if you don't know johnny go check out johnny uh he's got an awesome channel we get a lot of the same requests in on the same day it's pretty weird we're, we're like long lost brothers or something man. uh but he sent me a ron gant a jose cardinal a juan gonzalez rookie auto Steve Carse score rookie. Uh, Mike Ro Roachford, Rockford, Rockford. Okay, I have the Gant. I think I needed the Cardinal. I have the Gonzalez. I needed the Carse. And I needed the Rockford. So I needed three of the five. So let's see what we traded him. We traded for the Rockford. We traded Bill Wegman. Collector's Choice for the Ron Gant. We're sending Mike Eastler. Mike Eastler was a stud, and I love that 84 Donruss. I figured he would enjoy the 84 Donruss, too. For the Jose card, no, I didn't have any of these Legend cards. I would have liked to send him a Legend card uh, because I know he collects that set, but I didn't have any extras of him. So I sent him this cool card I knew he probably didn't have. Uh, it's another cool Scott McGregor card. I sent him a Scott McGregor card in the last trade that he didn't have, but that's the only thing I could think of that I thought he probably didn't have that I thought he might like because it's cool. McGregor was a good ball player. And for the one Gonzalez rookie, I'm going to send him to Danny Tartable. Uh, Danny charges, I think, 2 or $3 in the mail. For some reason, I accidentally sent him uh, 289 Fleers that, you know, throughout the days that I've sent to him. So I figured uh, Johnny might appreciate that. Uh, Steve Carse, we're trading a Frank DePino. Just because it was handy. <laughs> but hopefully you like those cards, Johnny. 
And like I said, if you guys want to do a blind trade, you can send me up to seven cards, whatever you know you can fit for a stamp. So send up to seven cards, and then I'll, like I said, I'll send you cards back about the same era, the same kind of players. And uh, that way you can try to help me try to build my sets, and I can maybe help you try to build your sets and stuff. So it's just something fun for us to do and gives us something to do, and it only costs us a stamp, you know. So let me know, guys, if you want to do some trades. Just my P.O. box is in the description. Uh, once again, I want to thank you guys for watching. If you made it for this far, you are definitely uh, a true collector and a true friend. And I wish you guys well. Have a good one. Send in your trades. Please like, please subscribe, and please hit the all buttons, hit the bell. Peace.